wanted to do a reading on my journey, you know, what's going on. So here we have Eagle Maiden. You know, I know within myself, you know, this is kind of, you know, a little bit the emotion things. I know within myself, I want to go back to that former time, you know, when I used to have an RV and I got to live in it for a year. And, uh, you know, uh, that was before I, before I took off uh, to India to complete my spiritual journey. You know, I had that time where I had the RV and I got to be there and I was free, you know, within myself to do that, okay? So it's like wanting to go back to uh, be able to have that experience again, you know, within myself of that truth and, and you know, enjoyment of that. So, so again, in the past, you know, the shaman's drum, I did my spiritual path, and I've given all the knowledge, everything I have to the world. I've done that for 20 years, you know. It's been 20 years <laughs> that I've been giving that out. You know, I wrote my book. I wrote the book on, on what it takes, what can aid people in their journey. Um, if they're going through Kundalini, I've faced all the things that you have to face with that. You know, all of that's done. That's done. That's what I've done in the past. It's finished. Okay. Underneath of it, again, foundation, that's done. Okay. Time to burn those arrows. That part is completed, and now it's like I want to go charging forward. I want to go to something, you know, refreshing, moving forward, you know, just going for it. <laughs> you know, charge. <laughs> Time to go forward. Time to move forward. You know, above it, we have, you know, I want to get ferried through, you know, I've done all this stuff. You know, it's, again, it's not going to be easy. you got to see what's going on the horizon. You know, it takes effort. You've got to get up to go do it if you're going to do it. If you're going to take that journey, you know. So that's what's above it, yeah getting ready to do that journey. And coming up is again, the journey, the chariot, moving forward. You know, in your dreams, your aspirations, new things, um, again, all coming together. Your hopes, your dreams, your aspirations, the things that, you know, new encounters, all of that, ready to go forward. It's, it's time to go forward. And so the final thing again, is the Eagle Patriarch. You know, I've got the knowledge already within myself. I've given it to the world. I continue to give it to the world. And again, I want to go out and share it, continue to share it with the world. But in this case, I want to do it while I'm on the move. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so again, you know, going forward into the world new adventures, taking the wisdom with me, you know, it, that, that doesn't leave. Whether I'm doing it from here or I'm doing it from the road, it's the same wisdom. Okay, that wisdom is there, you know, and it's time to, again, take it into the world. Okay, time to take it into the world. Continue the journey. Continue to enjoy that. Okay, so... Um, so the reading is all about just, yeah, time to continue the journey, go forward. Um, you know, I give the same advice out no matter where I'm at, whether I'm sitting here in front of this computer or I'm doing it from the road. It's the same advice, the same wisdom, that doesn't change. Um, so I will continue to do that. But it's time to, again, do a few of my own, uh, the things that I want to do, because I've really put my stuff on hold 
for a lot of years to be able to create the path for others to, to um, give them direction and guidance. But really, you know, I found over the years, I've given everything that I have to give. There's nothing new to say. Um, and everybody has to walk their own journey. So um, since that's already been provided for people, you know, it's now time for me to be able to go and enjoy a little of the, you know, what time I have left on this planet Earth to, to go and enjoy my journey as well. Say, so, <laughs> I'm not abdicating, I'm not leaving people in the lurch or anything. You know, I will still continue to be doing this whether I'm here or I'm on the road. You know, I will still continue to be giving out what I can give. And um, hopefully helping people in their journeys to get to a place where they are content within themselves. Okay. So I'm going to go now and pick up the RV. I've decided the name of the RV is just going to be Hawk. The RV is Hawk. And I am taking my feather to put in there. I'm taking the feathers to um, keep there. Hawk. Okay. So I am going to go down and and uh, pick up the RV tomorrow, and then Hawk and I will be continuing the journey. And uh, you know, you guys will just get different scenery along the way. Okay. <laughs> so I will be showing you some of the scenery out there, and uh, hopefully you enjoy the scenery rather than looking at this. All the time you get to see something new, okay? And I get to see something new, okay? And then I, as soon as I'm done, I'm gonna come back and pick up you too. I'm gonna take, take you too, you two little monkeys. Oh my goodness, oh. I'm gonna come back, I will come back. Raj knows I'm going and he was, where, where's Raji? Oh, Raji was over here shaking. I was holding him. He's shaking. He could tell when I'm going. He knows. He is so smart. Are you smart? You're a smart baby. You're a smart baby. You are. Yeah, you see, your brother loves you. He's saying, don't be sad, brother. They say, don't be sad, brother. Yeah, don't be sad, brother. I give you kisses. Sid and Nanda's going to take care of us. Don't worry. And Mommy will come back, and then she will pick us up, and we'll all go together. Yeah. Because they like it. You know, when I had that trip that I did in the van, they loved it. They loved it. Like I said, Raj has been on a big trip before on the motorcycle. Raj has been all the way. Did you ride the bike? Did you ride the bike? Did you ride the bike? Yeah, did you go on the bike? Oh yes, you went a couple times too, yes. They said, we did, I rode the bike. I had my doggles and everything. I did, I was a big boy. So I was a big boy and I, I oh my, no, we're not gonna go ride a bike now. No, 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 we're not going riding a bike now. No, 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 no. We did that before, the bike is gone. Okay, <laughs> as you can see, they like to go, <laughs> okay? <laughs> and Raj actually did ride on the bike. I had a, I had a big trike and uh, had a little motorcycle bag like this that he would sit in the motorcycle bag. It's a little doggles on looking out. He loved it because he felt safe there. He went through the summer heat. He went through the snow. He said, we went up through the pass and he was so funny. I had him wrapped in so many clothes. He had, you know, they had that movie where the dog 
flew out the window and he came back and he saw him in a cast, all four legs in a cast. Well, that's what Raj was looking like. He couldn't move. He was cast. He had so many layers of clothes on him. He was just stuck like that. He was... <laughs> Say, well, that's when we went over the pass in Colorado and it was so cold. Oh my God, it was cold. So he's been on the big journey before. He has made a big journey with me. That's before we got, that's before I got Maxi Poo. Yeah. So he's been on a journey before. And Max is a goer. Max is a goer. So he's, he's, yeah, I know, I know you want to go. I know, I know. So when I get back, I will be picking these two up. And then it'll be the three of us in Hawk on the road. So... <laughs> troublemakers me and the troublemakers yeah they said we've got our own seat well there's there's ronald i gotta go time to hit the road see you online oh